People in coastal communities tell me this they're appalled this Prime Minister is still recklessly pushing the expansion of Trans Mountain. The court ruled the assessment process was deeply flawed and didn't even consider the sevenfold oil tanker traffic increase and the risks it put on orca whales and our coast. And yet Liberals still have taxpayers on the hook for billions, buying TMX instead of investing now in the housing people desperately need. So what will the Prime Minister do? Will he finally listen to coastal communities and cancel this pipeline expansion before the Honourable <laughs> Minister of Fisheries. Mr. Speaker, um, in the context of this project, the government took the position that environmental sustainability and economic progress needed to go hand in hand. We followed with that mantra all the way through. Even though the scoping of marine shipping was scoped out by the previous government, we focused very much on marine shipping. We focused on the plight of the killer whales. We've worked very hard on those issues, and we will be taking some of that information and providing to the National Energy Board as it moves through the process that has been now established.